I know we don't have a really good researcher to start with, um, but researching the solar generators is something I really want to do because the wind turbine, you know, you're only getting power when it's windy. And to that effect, you also want to get a, um, a uh, battery. Research the battery, too. Simple research bins will have a speed penalty outdoors. Oh, because they haven't finished the, the doors yet. These two doors. That's fine. We're not actually researching yet. Yeah, so in here... Yeah, let's see. We have access to get the solar panels. And where's the battery? And the battery. Which I wanted to start on the battery once we get the research going. I guess that's the problem with building everything out of wood is that you keep running out. Oh no, they're already... Oh, yeah. They're already set to chop. They're just not able to keep up with everything right now. Oh, so we don't want to... We need to finish this. Yeah, let's uh, turn the power. Well, there's, I guess there's no reason to turn it off because there's nothing else to be working on right now. A group of Maribun orderly unification are visiting the colony. Lady and Leaf. Just visiting. A blacksmith and a shelter kid. Welcome. Welcome to... Did our colony have a name? I don't think our colony has a game has a name yet. Welcome to our little colony. Need defenses. Pirate where you've been you've been here some time and have probably been seen. Pirate raids will start shoot soon. You should prepare defenses like sandbags or traps. You know what? That's a very good point. We should. We'll put a some sandbags over here. Mm, maybe some up here? Well, these people came from down here. Where are we at in the world? Yeah, people might come from any direction. I'm not really sure if that really matters, like where they are on the map, but we'll set up some sandbags. So they don't, uh, they don't hate us. They didn't come in here and immediately just start berating us for existing. That's a good start to any relationship. I don't really want to do a fueled stove because I don't have a lot of wood anyways. Dr. Furies. still have 28 package survival meals. They give you kind of a lot to start off with. That's pretty nice. I can imagine somewhere, like if you went to like a winter biome or something where there weren't as many trees to start off with, you might even need all of that because it'll be harder to build, you know, everything. Well, hopefully this panther doesn't get any ideas. Also, there's a bunch of steel here that's forbidden. What's this? Oh, is that that chinchilla? Oh, you put it out here and it decomposed. Or no, it's not spoiled yet. Maybe I should change this to... Not corpses, but just human-like corpses. And then we can put... Okay, this will be our freezer. And in here, we can put raw food and meals. 
and animal corpses. She's bringing in a bunch of wood to finish this stuff off with. Ah, oh, you screwed up the wall. Now you gotta try again. You're just gonna pretend like it didn't happen? Just leave a giant gaping hole in the wall? I'm sure no one will notice. It's perfectly fine. Okay, now this is technically indoors. A mad chinchilla. A local chinchilla has gone mad. It will attack everyone it sees. Where's it at? It's pretty close. Uh, Thaler, we need you to get on this. Is it coming? Yes, you can see it. Ooh, close. Oh, jeez. Uh, it's just a chinchilla. Just attack it. There you go. No, don't consume the corpse. Can you, like, haul it? Can I prioritize? Oh, it's forbidden. Hold on. Prioritize hauling chinchilla. Yeah, don't just eat it. That's, that's not what I want. And thank you. So we have a working freezer. Close. We got started. I don't care so much about the, uh, the chairs. I want the freezer right here. There you go. Thank you. Now we can set this to. Uh, like 26? 26 is probably fine. Also, what are you doing now? You're still... still building. Can I focus on the walls first, please? There we go. No, 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 finish the walls. There you go. Now you can go relax socially before bed. I'm trying to think what else I should do. So we can set up bells here. Let's go butcher creature forever. We get one, it'll butcher it. Let's also go. Well, no, because we need like hay and stuff. Or we need like some meat and some vegetables to make kibble for our animals. Um, we'll, f we'll worry about that later. They can eat just meat for now. Or they, our, our one animal, our doggy. Hello, doggy. You have a bed. Is it not comfortable enough for you? You're, you're just like my dog. Who's actually in her bed right now. <laughs> but a lot of times, she sleeps just on the wooden floor. Right next to the bed, usually. So this is good, we only have a few more things to build to... to start our beginning here. I know I need batteries, we don't... We don't know what a battery is yet. So where did this tree come from? Get out of here, tree. Yeah, it's making our wind turbine not as effective. Might have to build a floor there to stop uh, stop things from randomly growing. 
What are you doing, Carlotta? You're gonna go eat some food? There you go. I think I saw some more, but I had gotten distracted. Where were those? Did I already pick them up? Maybe I didn't get distracted. Oh, there is some steel over here we can unforbid. Maybe that's all we have for now. We'll deconstruct the ship parts uh, that are randomly falling around. Like this right here. But I'm going to give it just a little bit longer. Also, we can probably set up, now that we have a freezer, we can set up our hunter to hunt uh, some things like, you know, not the elephants, like the... I could probably hunt the alpacas. That's a cassowary. Oh, it's that bird thing. Oh, it's kind of cool looking. Let's kill it. Oh, it has a chance to fight back. Let's not kill it. Our hunters aren't that great yet. The alpacas will give us a lot of food. Also, we might want to start a little farm, since we do have someone who can grow pretty well. Uh, zone, growing. Let's do... I know that, like, in the tutorial, the game tells you to do rice first. I'm wondering why that is. It has a shorter grow time, I guess. Three days. Potato. Take 5.8 days. Yes, yeah, so the potatoes have a higher yield where they take longer, but this is a good fertilized zone, or isn't? Oh no, it's not. It's marshy soil. I thought it was a good fertilized zone. Potatoes are fine. We've got a little bit of meat. We've still got 20 survival meals. Yeah, two potatoes, because that'll give us a higher yield. Oh, yeah, our is not super pleasing. I know you need the best room, so maybe we should put something else in your in your bedroom to make yours just slightly better than everyone else's, so you'll be happy. I tell ya. Is there anything I can put in there? I guess I could put a plant pot. There we go. Is that your bedroom? Yeah, that's your bedroom. I'll give you guys lamps once we get batteries, so we're not just relying on one one uh, wind turbine for all of our power. Okay, we've got some uh, some sandbags going. And I still have a ton of berry bushes I could harvest from if the potatoes aren't quite ready in time. I'm sure we'll be fine though, because there's three people. So that should last, you know, a little over six days. And we've got her out hunting alpacas. Where is she? Yeah, she's out hunting alpacas. Well, it looks like you hit one at one point, because there is some blood. Did you hit any of them? Oh, that one has asthma. Oh yeah, you hit this one. At this rate, it's going to bleed out before you kill it. Have you tried actually hitting it? Maybe she'll get it eventually. Oh, that was close. Oh, you hit the other one. You hit the one you weren't aiming for. Oh, now you're, now you're aiming for that one. You're like, no, nah, I was aiming for that one the whole time. Oh, you got that one in the neck. He's bleeding out. <laughs> the uh, the pleasures of early game hunting. Or unless you get someone that has a randomly good, like really good shooting. It takes them a while before they're actually, oh, you got distracted. But no. 
Well, that's your problem. You keep going back and forth. They're all gonna bleed out pretty soon. What's everyone else doing? We built this. Oh, yeah. See, this is why we need... Oh. Yeah, that chinchilla's rotting. Uh, how do I... Don't allow rotten in here. Uh, and you can allow rotten in there. Or actually, what we can do is we can go ahead and say yes to the animal corpses, but we'll just make this one a higher priority. Uh, preferred. How about the meat? Uh, it's, it's not great. Okay, good. We have research. So who can research? And I know you're terrible, but it's better than nothing. Oh yes, our, our hunter doctor. Um, it's better than nothing. Maybe I should focus on solar panels first, because this keeps turning off, because there's no wind. It shouldn't take her too long, right? Oh, please tell me you didn't butcher the rotten chinchilla. You didn't. Okay, good. Thank you. <laughs> we still need power, though. That would be nice. Come on, you're, you're trying. You're trying to give me power. There you go. You got a day lily. Does that actually have beauty? Yeah, that's quite a bit. Are you happy now? You have the best bedroom? I'm greedy. <laughs> I'm greedy. My room is pathetic. I want a really impressive bedroom. I like to imagine that's her actually saying that, like, oh, excuse me, I'm greedy. And my room is pathetic. Can I can I get a better room because I'm greedy? That'd be nice, thank you. Also, it's too hot. Yeah, it is pretty hot. And that's interesting that it's permanent summer down here. <laughs> Are you going in here just to cool off? I suppose I can't blame you. Uh, yeah, it's basically bedtime for them. I have to commend this game for its dog physics. I have a very nice you know, a sleeping box in here next to the person who is this dog's, what is it, did it say owner? Or what is it, what did it say? Master, being together with my bonded animal makes me feel better. So with it's, with its master. But when given the choice, it will sleep on the floor near somebody else every time. That is very much a dog thing. I have to keep reminding Bree to lay in her bed. 